hey look we're back and when we last left off we were not here so i don't know why but i just had this massive fucking urge to like i'm going to be op like there's no stopping it this game gives you way too many tools to just be broken and i'm probably gonna end up easily being level 90 by the time i get to the final boss so without getting too much into spoilers i decided to make some ultimate personas like damn near perfect Technically, this could be a tiny bit better by being Drain Curse. Uh, this one, perfect, no flaws. Um, again, perfect. I just got Drain Electric as an item, and I'm not going to use it quite yet because I want to make a duplicate so that I can have Yusuke make more of them. Again, per, uh, technically, this could be slightly better by being Drain Nuke. Perfect. And perfect. So yeah, I just want to show you the level of stupidity I'm not able to pull off because of just how hard I spent min-maxing. How long did this take me? Let's not go into that. Let me just show you some straight up stupidity though. Well, then. I just want to show you a, a quote unquote boss fight. And before I one shot myself because the boss is immune to, it's going to reflect physical. So what's going on in the video game industry? Oh, you know something that's going on in the video game industry? Um, what's it called? GTA 6. GTA 6 finally got its trailer drop, and it looks pretty cool. I can feel it. Like, GTA 6, the GTA series has never been a series that I've cared about all that much. Like, I've enjoyed it, but it's not my go-to series for games. And that you can probably tell just by, you know, the kind of games hey, I play on my channel. Chest. It's fun time. Yeah. There's a chest. Joker, let's open it. I'm more of an RPG guy, as you can kind of see based off my channel. But I'm happy for the people who are finally getting GTA 6 after shit. 10 years now? Yoish. It's somewhere. The world that panders to your every whim is so mundane. Where's the thrill if there's no competition? I agree. Though the world may appear beautiful at first blush, it is merely disguising its true nature. By the way, massive Excellent. spoilers. Oop, let me snag this. I'm literally just going to show you one boss fight, and then I'm going back to my actual daily. Huh? This is what I... Thank you, Futaba. All right, let's do this. Then. Is this the one guy who wants to kill himself, or is this the guy who... I, wait, I forgot what the other one was. See. So he's now Minamoto. He wants to die because he hurt his sister. Yeah, this guy who wants to kill himself because he hurt his sister. We can't leave him. This is lucky he's got the resolve for someone who wants to commit suicide. Joker. Be careful, Joker. Man, if these, you really came good. I won't be able to hurt my sister ever again. No. I'm not here to kill you. We're here to change your heart. What? Change my heart. I want you guys to kill me because because I I hate her. I hate my sister for getting in the way of my life. If it weren't for her, I would have gone to high school and college. I could have hung out with my friends instead of working all the time. Maybe I could have joined a school club. What was that? Those were harder. There's still a part of you that wants to protect her. Maybe that means giving up your time, right? Yes, I shouldn't I shouldn't think these thoughts. It's not true. I want her to have a different life than I do. I really want her to be happy. Aw oh, man. I feel so bad for this guy because his plotline, his story is that his parents died uh, when he was young, so he had to take care of his sister, and because he's taking care of his sister, he doesn't get to have a life of his own, and it's kind of driving him to the brink. Maybe there's nothing that was in my request. Those who seek to wrongly influence my sister deserve to disappear. My guy, calm down. Let's go. We got I shall be your opponent. Persona. Debilitate. All right. Persona. All set. Boom. Boom. And boom. 
this and now let me show you well first let me check this thought so all right thank you for testing for me i wonder are you even using a gun nope how about zio Nope, you reflect that. No cut. No. Strong and immune to physical trauma. Brute force won't work. Death How about this? Money. Nope, you reflect that. No good. This could be tough. I am down. Death will be nullified to be purple. Let's go. Let's charge up. Hmm. What persona? This enemy is tough. An electric attack won't work on it. Persona! I wonder. Can I put you to sleep, maybe? There we go. Nope. <laughs> oh, this guy's gonna hurt. Should be able to dodge it though. You're mine. You're dead. Perfect. Let's show them some real power. Fun fact. Uh this is actually affected by charge. Behold. Saucy. Zesty. Masterpiece. Ain't nothing better than this. Get out, dumbass! Here you go, my tree. Yeah. Nice. Yes, you How are you eating that through a mask, buddy? That's right. I'm. I mean, the fact that you became a legendary hero to like stand up for yourself kind of showcases you don't want to die. You're also pretty fucking strong. How are you right? feeling? Can you calm down. It must have been hard to tell yourself that you hate your sister. Yeah, it was not something I told myself, huh? I refuse to believe that some part of me felt that way about my sister. The more I refused it, the larger the feeling got until it became monstrous. And now I accept that part of myself. Could Does it this be? mean you really did hate your sister? Yeah, those are my true feelings. But it's also true that I love her. Both feelings were real. Do you still want to kill you? One wants to kill you? No. If I die now, my sister will be all alone. I can't let it happen. Probably can't be with my sister after injuring her, but I'm so glad I'm able to feel to feel that I love my sister. Again. I owe you one. Thank you. Now, see, if he was a main care a pro tag in Persona 4, he would have just gotten his uh, Persona right then and there. And we're going to return the entrance. All right. Yeah, I just wanted to show you what Let's do it. kind of stupidity I'll be getting into. I'm going to dedicate an episode just to working on fuses, though, so... It'll be, I'm okay. It took me around like five to six hours to get to this point, but uh, yeah. Either way, let's go back to our real save file. I'll be back. Holy shit. Am I so glad that I rotate saves? That's another reason why you always rotate saves, kids. Every time. There is never... You should all... If you have extra slave slot... Uh, slave. Save slots, you should always rotate your fucking saves. Because you never know when some bullshit like that's gonna happen. Also, this persona right here will be one of the, that skill right there will be one of my necessary ones to make my ultimate persona, as you saw later. That is the only persona in the game to get trigger happy. Now then, let us actually continue with this episode proper and talk to Haifumi. 
I first, however, like I'm gonna save. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I'm dumb as shit. It's fine, though. It is a-okay. Hey, Hayafumi. <laughs> my thinking gets sharper on rainy days. The sound of raindrops increases my focus. I did what I could to prepare for the exhibition match, and so... Oh, do you have some time? I feel a little bit anxious. Sure. Thank you. Thank you. After I confess, I was scorned by the media. I bet everyone wants me to lose. However, I'm not going to give them the satisfaction. I'm going to win with these very hands. Give it your all. Uh, so, yes. of course. Well, it's time. I have to go to the venue. I won't be able to go inside the mat. You won't be able to go inside the match room, but you will be able to watch me in it if you like. All right. Now, I should be going. Uh, and it's an online broadcast of the match. The announcers are commentating on the gameplay. Is this the end of the road for the phony princess? She's getting pushed back quite a bit. It's only a matter of time now. Hafumi is biting her lip. She doesn't seem to be doing so well. Oh, that was a masterful play. Perhaps her skills are the general in our people. Oh no, that's not good. The next move will surely result in a checkmate. Hafumi looks trouble as she's being pushed around the board. She hasn't made a move. I'm thinking the phony princess real defective as the headline of our next article. I concede. Yup, she didn't win. There's nobody destroyed out there. It was if it was this as if an elephant had challenged an elephant, a shogi player should know her limits. That was the first time I have ever forfeited a match. I was so ashamed of myself. I didn't want to hurt the pieces any longer. A very queenly decision. You remember, one must concede defeat with grace, maintaining dignity until the very end as a queen should. But I confess I'm confused. I mean, naturally I'm disappointed that I lost, but I feel happy, as if a demon had been purged from me. The moment I realized that victory was impossible, I felt a strange peace. What's important is what I do from this point on. I place so disgracefully in front of you. Perhaps you can just view it as an example of what not to do. And understand that there are times which require one to forfeit with valor and grace. Decrease turn delay to zero, allowing you to instantly escape battles. So, aka, if you do get caught, you just want to run, you can just instantly dip. Um, um, I've been thinking of this for a while. Let's make today your last lesson. Spending time with you has only brought me pain. So this is goodbye. But I want to become stronger. The things you say sometimes. Perhaps I should take a lesson from your ambitious nature of yours. <laughs> if that is what you wish, then prepare yourself. Your training will become quite intensive. There may be things I can learn from you as well. I suppose this is a friendly rivalry for both of us, as a replaceable Shogi friends. Let's go home. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, uh... Chess... I'm sorry, Chess Queen. <laughs> Reject Chess Queen. Acquire Boys Night Out. Thank you for being so much for today. I've been thinking this entire time. About how things would have been if I had kept playing Shogi according to my mother's strategy. I could have enjoyed a transient empty success when I looked two and three moves ahead. I saw myself in an incessant hell, playing a pur purgatorial. I might, I my brain's too small for those words. Shogi, unable to ever win or lose. I probably wouldn't have ended up hating Shogi, perhaps even given up on life. That's why I can say this with certainty: today's loss was not a setback, but a glorious step forward. Let's win the next one. Yes. I was thinking the same thing. It's so encouraging to have someone who truly understands me and I'm so happy. Alright, I should go. But I'm looking forward to seeing you again. Maybe Sunday, but the time of relaxation is ruined by all those noise outside. Yep, no matter where I go, I hear these election speeches. Fine if it was that was all. She knows calling himself a brave hero stood up to a vile terrorist. Don't make me laugh, he's nothing but rotten scum. It seems he's been using the fantasies as ammunition for his political activities. Only two weeks until the elections. And it's been exactly two weeks since the news of Ren's suicide. We should probably hurry. They'll probably be killed if they learn he's still alive. I know. Just give the word, and when you're ready, we'll all come over. Uh, we found the treasure. Don't care. Uh... 
So there's nothing I can do today? The horrific dramas unfolded before me. I never expected such frightening uproar. You mean the elections? I don't care about the rig race, we're talking about the blog being attacked. <laughs> All I did was praise my film critics under another name, and it was just a bit of acting. Somehow the internet found out and hates me now, and the jurors get worse when I explain myself. Perhaps this is a sign. Perhaps I'll move on from critiquing films to the next stage of my career. Well, I'll be going home soon. What a pompous asshole. <sighs> she know this and she know that. The world's gone to hell. Can I read right now? Hey. Can I read in my room? Because right now, there's nothing I can really do, so... Hey. Oh. Wow, I can't read during the day at all. Um, let's see. Is there anything I want to do? I don't want to sit. I don't want to do the palace today. I'm just not. I'm not feeling it. Especially after that nonsense I just pulled. Oh, that could have been so bad. Um. Let's do a fortune reading. What shall we do? Infinity reading with Haifumi. else that I want to... Do I have, like, anything else I can do? Not really, no. Fuck it, we'll go to the temple. Oh, hi. Oh, senpai? Are you kind of tired? Are you okay? You want to give yourself... I'll give it your best, but please don't push yourself too hard. Would you like to go hang out today? I mean, I literally have nothing else to do, so fuck it. What do you want to do? Yes. Want to go to a shrine? Yes, let's go there. I probably should have actually spent time to like trying to raise my stats, but whatever. So anyway. I really like the atmosphere of shrines. There's something inspiring about them. Do they places like this often? Pretty often. He said so. Well, I should probably don't go as often as you, Senpai, but I like to drop by now and then. I might have told you this before, but whenever I had a huge competition, my little sister would bring me here. And now that I think about it, I guess it was a bit pretty superstitious. Oh, and since we're here, let's pray. It couldn't hurt, right? I'll be heading home okay, now. Okay, two bows, two claps, and then how does it go again? Mm -mm. Don't ask me. All right, what are my options for today? Iowa. Is he my last eight? No, I have two more eights. I have him and her. That said, yeah, we're hitting it. All right. Perfect. I think that's a pretty good stopping place. So this episode was a perfect showcase on why you should rotate your saves. <laughs> Either way, I want everyone out there to have a good morning, evening, day, or night, wherever you're at. But for right now, I am out. Later.